Oh yeah. <gasps> Holy crap! That's good. Oh my god. We don't have to meet at the bar getting drinks. Hey guys, Jasmine and George here. We are doing a boba snack haul today. Also, if you're wondering why I am looking like this, I just filmed an ABG video. You can check it out on my channel. I just changed into something a little more comfortable. All right, so I went to 99 Ranch and I found a few boba treats. I just snatched them off the shelf and my mom was like, do you really need that? I did, I did need it. And so I bought them all and then I also have one that I got from Taiwan a while ago and I wanted to show you guys because I really like this one. So this is the brown sugar bubble tea ball and this one is a pack of 10. This is what the package looks like. Very nice packaging. Yeah, it looks really good. Yeah. All right. Ooh. So describe this. It looks like it's like chocolate on the outside and boba on the inside. That's what it looks like. It reminds me of a big Whopper. I would say the lightness to milk tea is there in the aftertaste, but while you're eating it, it just tastes a little chemically. It's actually really good if you let the chocolate melt, but the chocolate doesn't melt very quickly. It's like very hard. You're right. It's better melted, right? It's much better melted. It tastes way less artificial and more like milk tea when it's melting. The taste I feel like is actually pretty good, but the consistency of it, because like you have to eat it a very special way. You know? <laughs> it's only good if you have the technique down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you have to be a pro like us. You know? <laughs> Would I buy this again? Maybe. But the thing is, I feel like I wouldn't want to buy it again because I know that this exists. This is a chocolate boba gummy ball as well. And I already, it's already like pretty much empty because I've been eating it. And they are individually wrapped like this. All right, here goes. Cheers. So this one, the chocolate, the texture is really good. Uh, it melts a little bit better than the last one. The last one was kind of hard, but the other one tastes more like a brown sugar milk tea and this one is like a little bit different. For this one, the chocolate on the outside tastes more like white chocolate, but the inside boba gummy tastes like legit boba. This is the next one, a boba milk tea candy. This one is a product of Japan. Remember when we went to Japan and we had the boba milk tea haichus? Those yeah, are yeah. so good. It tasted <laughs> just like boba milk tea. So I have high hopes for this one. Yeah, Japanese candies I feel like tend to be pretty good quality. They nail down the flavors. Okay, individually packed. <gasps> So this one's a hard candy mm -hmm. with a boba inside. Ooh, it looks like one of those caramel drops. Yes, cheers. Uh, yes. Mm. Mm. Oh. oh my god. Hell yeah. Holy crap. That's good. Oh my god. There's so much flavor, like oh more god. than I would ever expect from a hard candy. This tastes literally like the royal milk tea from Lollicup. Rip, Lollicup, love you. Oh, it, it's wet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a whole lot. There are moments where I feel like it's a little chemically though. A little bit, yeah. George has taken the gummy out of his mouth just to show you guys. That's the gummy. All right, let's move on to the last one. Boba popcorn. Boba popcorn. Look how cute this packaging is. Oh, jeez. Oh God, that sounds like milk tea. Do you guys know if there's like a boba milk tea candle? I would like to purchase that. Oh, you know what? I just realized, okay. They're, they're, I think it's colored boba and milk tea, <gasps> or like maybe brown sugar and milk tea. I'm not sure. Tastes like kettle corn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see this one. Cheers. It's good though. Brown sugar. Brown for sugar. Sure. Yeah. yeah. Together. It's kettle corn. Yes. It is lovely. Very, very good, but it's not boba milk tea, that's for sure. I mean, the aftertaste slightly, mm. but it could be because like we just ate a bunch of mm. boba candies, so I still have the flavor in my mouth. Yeah, if I'm being brutally honest, I don't taste too much of the boba milk tea. It just tastes like pretty good kettle corn. All right, guys, that's it for our boba snack haul. Let me know in the comments below if you've seen other boba snacks that you think I should try. And for now, we sip on this. Finally sharing a boba with me? No. Bye! <laughs> On a Vespa in a sunflower field, yeah. Warm wind blowing and birds are singing in cypress trees. Tuscany.